So, the continuation of the posterior sec, uh, video, this is the tongue. In the tongue, you can notice that these are the muscular fibers, these are mus muscles of the genioglossus. These are the muscle fibers of the genioglossus. Uh, you can also barely notice the fibers of the superior longitudinal layer or the transverse fibers. These are the superior longitudinal or transverse fibers. You can notice the orientation of the fibers, these are going like this. These are the transverse fibers and these are the fibers of the genioglossus. And if we lift the genioglossus above, the, the second fibers that are going in this fashion here, these are the fibers of the genuhyoid. These are the fibers of genuhyoid and in the most inferior part, this muscle fiber, this muscle is the mylohyoid. Mylohyoid, genuhyoid, genioglossus and the superior longitudinal layer. This is the hyoid bone, this structure is the hyoid bone. So you can notice that this, these muscles are going and they are attaching on the hyoid bone. This is the cut section of the mandible and this is the first cervical vertebra and this is the second cervical vertebra. First second and this is the body of the sphenoid and this is the sphenoidal ear sinus. You can notice that the bony projections are dividing the sphenoidal ear sinus into multiple smaller parts. These are the bony projections. Bony projection, again here is a bony projection, the bony projection. This is dividing the sphenoidal sinus into very small elevations and depressions and the parts. This is the body of the sphenoid, this is the first cervical vertebra and this is the second cervical vertebra and this is the third, fourth, fifth, sixth and seventh. Now from the side of the face, this is the masseter muscle cut section of the masseter. Beneath the masseter you can notice that this is the ramus of the mandible, angle, this is the angle and this is the ramus of the mandible, this one. Angle, ramus and this is the inferior border of the mandible. Cut structure is the parotid gland. This is the parotid gland and uh, here you can notice a muscle here, this muscle, this is the sternocleidomastoid. And uh, if you lift it up, you will find the contents of the carotid sheet in the carotid triangle. This is the internal jugular vein. Lifting it up, this is the internal carotid artery and this is the vagus nerve. This lobe is of the thyroid gland. You can notice a vein here, this is the facial vein, this is the submandibular gland, and if you will come posteriorly, this muscle is trapezius. This was sternocleidomastoid and this was trapezius. Between the, the, these two there will be the posterior triangle of neck here. This muscle is the mylohyoid if we see from here. Earlier we have seen from the sagittal section and here we are seeing from the side of the face. This is mylohyoid and this is the anterior belly of the digastric which has been cut here. Anterior belly of the digastric muscle. 
ठीक है समझ सो दिस इज द स्पेसिमिन ऑफ द फेस होप सो यू हैव अंडरस्टूड थैंक यू